Yo, what's good, YouTube? We back with another video, man. So today we're gonna be doing a another mid fade, you know what I'm saying? But my boy haven't had a cut in a minute, you know what I'm saying? Been working, but we got a little growth. So first we're gonna put our ball line in, first guard line, and um, I'm gonna start with a higher guard because you know when cutting down hair has been growing out a lot. Some of the hair could be growing or laying different ways. So you want to just go in with a higher guard to see how the hair actually want to lay. Um, so you don't put any patches in here and stuff like that. So the first guard I'm taking to knock the hair down is going to be a three. And um, I seen that it wasn't cutting too much off, um, but it was getting a lot of the bulk off. So I went down to a two, you know what I'm saying? But the two was still... Uh, it was still cutting some off, but eventually I went down with a one and a half on the sides. And then when I go to the front of the head, um, he has a cowlick on one side. So his hair grows like down to the left on that way. So when I go to the front, uh, you'll see me comb in that direction. And then uh, like right now a little bit, I'm kind of like cutting it, but right there, boom, going to the side, coming that way, boom, going to the side. And um, you do that because if you if you just go straight down on that part, you will chop the whole lineup up and, and you don't want that, you know what I'm saying? So it's gonna be some furniture moving around in the shop and we don't need none of that. So be careful around those areas when they got calyx. Now start with this first guideline. It's gonna be the no guard open, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna go up about an inch. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna do that around the whole head, right? But before we get into all of that, I wanna thank y'all, bruh. I wanna thank y'all for running up that last video I just released. You know what I'm saying? We got about, we got 1K in like four days, man. I appreciate y'all. Really, I really do. So please like, comment, and subscribe. And go check out that last video if you haven't already. But as you can see, we done put in um, the first guideline, no guard open, you know, went over it multiple times to make sure it's all the same length. And then now we have a uh, two on, right? So we have a two on, I always recommend, like say if you knock the size down to one and a half, just go up a guard higher above that so you can fade into that one and a half and then you can work your way down from that two to that one and a half to that one to that 0.5 and then no guard open so i like doing that just because it's easier for me to blend in fading down and making sure like i keep the top of that fade part as dark as possible so yeah that's what i do and i think you guys should do it too but let's check this out though now we're starting with our one and a half so right now as you can see i'm using um, the corner of my clipper and it's the left side right so make sure y'all combing in the right direction going in the direction of the hair you know what i'm saying and as you can see look using that left side combing in like a, a slanted angle and make sure you're doing it so when you're cutting the hair, you can cut it faster, you know what I'm saying? So you don't have to go over it multiple times, but it's also laying down in the same time that you're cutting. So it's like, I don't, it's like, uh, it's like doing two things at once, you know what I'm saying? So if you cut in the right direction, it just makes the process go a little bit faster. And as you can see, that little panel is already lighting up so we can come in with that one. Now right here is a perfect example of me using the corner of the blade. Check me out, look. Left side, comb. Left side, comb. You know what I'm saying? Use, utilize them corners, man. It's gonna help you deal. It's gonna help you a lot. But right here, we got the one on, you know what I'm saying? Start open, work your way to halfway, and then close, you know what I'm saying? And while you're doing all of this, 
please comb in the right direction. You know, because if you don't, you're going to be cutting wrong and you're going to be going over the same spot. I'm like, bro, why it's not cutting? Because you ain't combing it, you ain't combing it right and you ain't cutting it right. So all these little keys is very essential. You know what I'm saying? So please do that. Now we got that point five on you. Feel me right. So now we getting that detail work and we attacking that little faint line to 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 come from that no guard to that one, that middle line. You see it right handed with that corner. Yes, sir. Start open. Hope y'all can see my guard is open. I just closed it up a little bit because I seen it one cut too much. But hitting that faint line with that corner, I'm utilizing that corner as much as I can. And as you can see, this line is coming out. It's coming out. Just just follow these steps and we go get you together. Yo, right here. Listen to me now. Listen to me. Please hit that subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? Please hit that subscribe button. You did. Please, please do that for me. But right now we're taking out that bald line. You know, so what I do with my bottom lines, right? I start I start closing just feather at it. Just feather at the real small until I see it move and then I uh open up halfway. Go up a little bit more. When it go up a little bit more, uh, I hit it again, open up a little bit more. And when I do that, it just just open up as you go higher. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't want to close it, because if you go too high and it's closed, man, you don't want to do that. You, you just don't want to do that. So open up as high as you go. Use them corners. You can see I'm using that corner. And even that on the skin, on the skin, I'm still combing in the right direction. <laughs> trying to tell y'all so. Comb in the right direction. Cut in the right direction, you're gonna be good. Montez, Montez, Montez. Now, this is where you finish the fade, you know what I'm saying? So, we go back after we done did all of that, after we done cut them up, we're going to go back and we're going to repeat the steps from part one, you know what I'm saying? So, throw that three guard back on there. Go over it a little bit, hit that, hit the top of the fade so you can light it up just a little bit how you want. Then put that two on, 
You know what I'm saying? Hit it again. Uh, uh, uh. Just, just, just perfecting the fade. Just using the corners and and just really getting my men together. Come on now. Stop it. Take your time on it. Don't rush. Please don't rush, man. The, the, the clients love when you take your time. Go back. Finish the fade. That's what I want to tell you. I finished the fade, bro. In the game, playing sport. Finish the game, bro. It's not how you start. It's how you finish. You no know, matter how long it take. Go back and finish that fade, bro. Your people going to rock with you. They're going to rock with you. Montez, Montez, Montez. Shout out to that man Martez on the beat because he going crazy. You know what I'm saying? He got the he got the vibes right. But as you can see, the fade is coming together. We're just going back detailing. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't get the uh, the part where I put the enhancements on. I don't know what happened. But in the next clips, you will see the fade be like bam. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna hit you like that. But <laughs> That's what happened. Um, I didn't get to get the enhancement part, but this fade is really done. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate y'all for tuning in, watching. Um, please like, comment, subscribe. And I'm going to try to keep dropping every week, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I see how y'all messing with me on, on the last two videos. So I'm going to keep it coming. I'm going to keep it coming. So please like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, boy, out. Watch it, watch it, watch it.